Hello, welcome back to Paul's Racing Channel. Now, I know on the last track guide, I said I wasn't going to do one for uh, the Nordish Life 24 hour, um, but I've done this one, it's not quite the same. So all it is going to be, basically, I'm not going to go through and do an actual guide for you uh, as such. I'm just going to, it's just a one-off fast, or sorry, not fast, because I'm not fast, but one-off full speed for me lap. Um, just to sort of show you um, basically how it is, um, but I'm not going to be giving you an actual guide in terms of uh, stop start with the uh, with the camera. So it just be a full lap um, the way around this circuit. This is going to be um, the final round, round ten of our championship. And uh, well, here we go. This is literally it. So as soon as this is over, that'd be it for this video. But uh, it might give you a little bit of an idea anyway for any of you that uh, was a little bit unsure. So uh, here we go then, just about to go over that start and finish line. Let's get my uh, proper display up. Start again, here we go. around this cool little uh, right left at the start and on the uh, the GP part of the circuit now a little bit wide here, we've got a little mistakes obviously I've just had the one crack at this didn't have any practice straight at it, straight to it and uh, so there's a few, one or two little mistakes around here which is inevitable really but uh, down now to this champion. It's part of this, the circuit, obviously, everyone will be pretty familiar with. Damn, I can't miss the apex by a mile there. It's slightly different chicane because of the 24 hour layout. And this is where we're about to join the Bush Life itself. But you can uh, stop this at any point while you, if you're watching it, if you need to, just to uh, have a look. But I'm not going to stop it at any point here. So here we go. Out of the arena area to the woodland. through that part. Just trying to be as gentle as you can in some of these corners. Flat now, just a slight lift up as you get to this corner here. You don't need to break just to lift the uh, accelerator and then flat through here. at the top of this this rise but at the top of the next sort of left hand I to just lift again I nearly, nearly yeah big squiggle there I nearly lost it at that point it's a lovely corner this one to really go around there straight line all this pretty much not probably call the names either of you and I Again, throw the car a little bit there, got to be a little bit careful over that rise around these S's. Again, got to take it quite easy around now. Go, the way you go now. Just a bit lift here. In fact, I might have dropped it down a gear there, which I probably didn't need to, to be honest. A bit wide on the exit of this one. 
right up on the curb there. It's a little bit wide, but it cost me too much. It's quite difficult, this bit. That's got to kind of, yeah, just roll around there, really. It's a tight hairpin here. Go a bit wide there if you're not careful. Power on now. It's next. Left hand is quite difficult, you think it's quite wide, but actually, if you go too far on this curve here, on the right, you will get a penalty there. Yeah, but cool. Now this one, up, flat now. To the next tight right hand up, not this left, flat through here. To the next right hand up, drop it down a couple of gears. Staying third, actually. Might do second now just to give it a little bit more uh, power on exit. Now it's flat for quite a long time now, just all the way flat, all the way through this part. Now okay, this next left hander here might need to lift. I've bottled it a little bit there. We've probably gone a little bit quicker through there. Can't go flat through there though. It's a tight right hander. Again, I think it's quite wide, but actually it's quite easy to run it off here. At that point. Now up to carousel. Now I do mess it up here. Go a little bit high up here. Yeah, I just messed it up at that point and slowed me right down. But try and hug that inside as much as you can. As I say, this is just my third by one and only attempt through here. Again, I must go wide at this point. In fact, go very wide, but managed to keep it on the track. And this next bit's a really lovely piece of track. Just go right through here now. Go. All this corner if you're not careful, go out to the right. It's, it's quite tight, this one as well. Running off to the left here. Again, not much runoff on the left. Ride these curves here, this one. Top of that one. Go, now there's a little hump in the road. Be careful of right here. Bang! Feel the car and hear it drop, can't you? If it hits the uh, circuit, just got to lift it at that point. Not brake on now. Flat through this now. Quite a lot curved there, actually. Drop it down the gear here. Go through. Most full speed. Again, good run off on the right hand side there. Now to the mini carousel. This is very difficult as well, a lot of camber, can throw the car, and again, have a brutal moment now, almost a back nearly come around on me there, managed to gather it up, the way through, that's it to the end of the lap now, pretty much, which is just flat now, all the way along this long, straight, back straight. People will be looking to slipstream at this point if they're close enough. to the top. There's a flash of lights or a wave at the cameraman on the bridge there. Hello. And all the way flat now. I drop it down. Let it roll through here. It's a difficult corner here as you've got to drop it down the gears. Again roll it through this bit. That is your lap of the Norwich Life 24 hour. So that is the end of my video. Hope you did enjoy that. As you start or finish, man, check a flag, man. Um, so yeah, just a quick one for you, just in case anyone wanted to uh, have a quick little peek and a little play around with that. And uh, yeah, well, I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, that'll be it for this championship. 
not sure whether I'm going to do the track guides for next time out. Depends on what your comments are. If anyone wants me to continue, I will. Obviously, um, I've done quite a few of them already, so um, I don't want to be covering the same ones again. But if there's any that I haven't done, obviously, let us know if you do need them. But uh, I might knock it on the head for next uh, the next championship season. Not sure yet. Let's see how it goes. But anyway, that's me done. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you soon. Cheers.